It's almost like I get more obsessed with it as I get older, where I'm actually just fascinated that we're sliding on ice crystals in the forests. Whereas when I was a kid, I just wanted to huck or something. Um, now I live in Colorado. I've lived here for the last three years. I don't know, it's interesting. Like, I lived in New York for just over 20 years prior to coming here. And I think when I was in New York, I got a lot of kind of inspiration out of like people and community and being part of that crazy buzz. And now that I'm here, I'm just finding a different type of inspiration out of the nature that's kind of surrounding this area. And I've always been interested in snowboarding. and I love doing it. And I, I, I kind of like this like mountain town lifestyle. It's kind of fun. The dog thing is up here, right? What's it called? I told you. Super Pup, something like that. I would say I started snowboarding when I was 11 and started skateboarding like a little <laughs> before that. And I guess what those things did for me is they kind of opened the gates for me to have a creative life, like to look at things in a different way. When I was young, I was really attracted to all the visuals that came with both things, you know, from like graphics to magazine layouts, videos. And in a lot of ways for me to do artwork and have it end up on a board like these K2 boards or like anything, it's, it's not like I feel like I'm giving back or something, but it's like I'm excited for my work to be in the realm that gave me so much inspiration and a life, I guess. No, because I saw, like I had roommates and stuff that went, they became pro snowboarders and it actually looked really tough. They had to like go to these spots and just huck off these jumps. And at the time it was like scary park tabletops that were like 80 feet long and you had to like do something no one had done over it yet it's just it just seemed intense so uh what got me here is kind of funny because i wanted to make art that didn't create a storage issue <laughs> <laughs> so I was just like, I'm going to work small. I'm going to work on paper, just kind of analog layering, no rules. And this is kind of like the foundation for the landscape boards. Hi, my name is Peter Sutherland and my artwork is on the landscape collection. It really, it really is when you think about it. That's what I'm interested in now is like what's actually happening, sliding on ice crystals in the forest. Like it's, it's special, you know? So. What do you guys think so far? Yeah, I think we can always do it again later.